Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having an amazing day today. Um, sending lots of prayers down to everybody in Florida and still down south from whoever's affected by the hurricanes and tornadoes. I watched some tornadoes live last night and I, I mean, I was scared just watching. So I can't even imagine how scared you are in those types of situations. Mother Nature can be a real beast, you know? But um, anyway, just know you're in my thoughts and prayers. I think of, of everyone daily, uh, you know, um, I, ju I just do. I, I The devastation is, is terrible, and you're in our thoughts and prayers. Okay, so, hello. <laughs> and if you're new here, my name is Jen, and I do mainly Timu hauls and some other hauls and some reviews, but today we're doing a Timu haul, and I'm sitting here in my Timu pajamas. It says Pumpkin Patch Girl. Um, I thought, heck with it, you know, I'm going to wear my pajamas in my video, you know, it's okay. Because I watch Timu hauls in my pajamas, I'll have you know. So, I hope you're sitting on the other side of this screen in your pajamas with a cup of coffee or hot cocoa or a Mountain Dew or whatever it is you, sweet tea or whatever it is you like to drink and you're watching my haul and it, it's very random today. <laughs> very, very random. I actually found this bag off to the side and it's dated July, so where did it come from? I don't know. But I thought we'll get it out of the way. It's a bunch of weird random things, but it's stuff that I bought that I thought I would use. Let's just get right into this. Uh, let me put my spectacles on so I can see what I'm doing. If you hear any weird noises in the back like that. That. That is the cats getting into the bags. By the way, we have adopted Kermit's brother, Oscar. Um, so Oscar is now with us, so we are a three-cat household. <laughs> I must be crazy. Yeah. That's them playing in the bags. So if that bothers you, I apologize in advance. If I stop every time they get in that bag, I'll never get this done. Okay, first item are these little, they're little lemon trees, and I thought they were adorable. I got them for free. I'm pretty sure I got these off of Timu Circle as a free item. Um, so obviously I won't be putting these out this year because we're into October. It is now fall here in Western Pennsylvania. So this is what they look like. Um, they're just like little tiny lemon trees, but I thought they would be really, really cute in the summer. They need floofed a little bit. They're just really tiny, but how cute would they be? Whoops, I'm going to drop it. How cute would they be in like a bathroom or something? So I got two of them. Um, or a kitchen would be really nice. But yeah, they need just a little bit. Really cute though. So yeah, I got two of those for free. These cats are not gonna, this is gonna not stop, I can tell. They're just gonna keep going and going. Okay, I got another one of these little humidifier things and it was the other free gift I got from Timu Circle. It's just a desktop USB humidifier, so I thought I would take it to work with me. Um, and I like the Pink Zebra diffuser oils. Um, shameless plug because I sell Pink Zebra. <laughs> but um, this one, is just a little desk model. Um, you, you plug it in and there's the cord. But I thought oh, that'd just be nice to keep at work with some diffuser oils and I can plug it into my computer and then that's kind of what it looks like down here at the bottom. Um, yeah. Yeah, they're, they're, they're just going to continue to play during this whole video. So, But uh, it, it has colors on it, too. So it's got seven colors of gradual change. And, yeah, I just thought it was kind of neat. Now, I don't know how you... Either this doesn't take a whole lot of water, or I have it upside down. Yes, I, 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 I had it upside down. Why didn't you guys tell me? Why'd you make me look stupid? Okay, anyway, I had it upside down. It goes like this, and it lights up around here, and here's where the water comes out, And but that's weird. Isn't that weird that there's... Isn't it weird that, like, the plug is on right here? I, I don't know. I'll figure it out, but I'll let you know how it works. Um, but I got it for free, so, I mean, you know, worst case scenario, it doesn't work. <laughs> and I'm not out anything, so... But yeah, I'm sorry, I was holding it up backwards. Like, what, I don't, what in the world? Okay, then I got this sweater. It's a 4XL. I'm gonna try and put a picture up of it if it's still even available. And 
I wouldn't, I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to tell you guys this. I said I would not buy any more Timu clothes and I, I don't know why I, I keep doing this to myself, but I bought this back in July. So now it's just a really big oversized kind of sweater with like a short sleeve, but it's like a drop sleeve. So it's going to drop down the arm, but I will tell you this fabric is kind of terrible. It's really scratchy, but maybe if I wash it and put some fabric softener, but it's literally just a big v-neck hot pink sweater so yeah it's not horrible but i don't know we'll see what it looks like on um but again that's probably going to be a like a next season type of item but it was 13.98 so then i got this sweater i think it's the exact same thing only i got this one for free so no money lost on this if i don't like it but it's this sky blue color, again, probably for next season, so I'll probably put them away for next year. But I got this one in a 4X as well, because I wanted it, like, big and oversized. And they are a little bit see-through, so you'd have to wear, like, a tank top underneath these. But I like that they had the V-neck, and I thought both of these colors would look really good if I had a tan. So, again, kind of shoulder-sleeved, but drop shoulder, so, I mean, here's my shoulders, so, like, this whole part's going to be, like, off my arm, but... It's very long, um, but again, they're a little bit scratchy, but you're going to have to wear a tank top underneath them because I can see my ring light right through it. So, so yeah, that one was free. And then, okay, I got some socks. They were free. D they were free. Okay. They were free. Don't judge me. They were free. 10 pairs free. <laughs> Someone out there is judging me. I know it because you guys know I buy a ton of socks off of Timu. I can't help myself. I love their socks. I might donate these because <clears throat> I know some people that are heading down south and they're taking like clothing and stuff. So I may just donate some of these because you get 10 pairs. Meow. 10 pairs. Even, even the cats are excited. Yeah. Yeah. You <laughs> That's Oscar. Um, you get two pairs of this yellow color. You get two pairs of this light blue color. And Tammy Naltil at TNT Halls. I know you're laughing. I know you're sitting over there judging and laughing. Please, guys, go check out TNT Halls. That's my friend Tammy, and she really needs some watch hours. So please go check her out. Um, yeah, purple. A couple pairs of purple. Then I love this one. It's like a black with like a really dark like gray or black on there. Love that. And then two pairs of white. So I don't, I probably won't keep all of these. I'll probably donate half of them since there's two pairs of each color. Um, but they were free. So again, I'm not out anything. So quit laughing at me because I got socks again. Okay. Then I got this. It's, this is like a tallow balm. They, it's, I think this is becoming popular, whipped tallow balm. But this was, was expensive. No, it was $3.48, so not super duper expensive. If it's really whipped tallow balm, I don't know. But it's uh, it's wrapped up really well. It's not very big. Um, it says herb infused. Oscar, what's the matter, buddy? He's very vocal. Oscar's very, very vocal. So this is herb infused nourishing face and body cream whipped tallow balm. It says it's tallow, olive oil, calendula extract, rose extract, and essential oils. So, I, I don't know. I don't know. Cool, cool container. Um, oh, it's got the lid thing. I don't smell anything. See, that's my fear with these products, is are they actually what they say they are? I don't know. You know? I mean, are they? Let's put some on my hand here. It does not smell at all. Like, I can't smell rose. I can't smell nothing. I don't smell olive oil. I don't smell rose. I don't smell any essential oils. Now, it's very thick and kind of greasy. So, I don't know. Ugh, I just don't know. It has no scent whatsoever. So, how do I know that it's a 100% grass-fed tallow raw balm? I, I don't, I just don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'll use it, but I just I just wonder if a lot of the products are really what they say they are. <sighs> I don't know. Okay, then I got this for $1.59. I know, and I if I say I don't know one more time or literally, you guys are probably gonna scream at me or slap me through the through the TV. $1.59 for this. Yeah, hi cats, cats over there. Um 
don't know what the heck it is. Crystal, crystal moisturizing lip oil in peach. Okay. Everything on this box is like not even, there's no English on this whatsoever. I don't, so it took me a minute. All right, looks like this. Skyvy, Skyvy peach lip oil. Um, crystal moisturizing. Okay. Let's see what it smells like. It's definitely fake peach. Fake peachy for sure. Let's see uh, if it gets sticky or anything. It's very like... I feel like it's gonna drip. <laughs> Look at me trying to talk while I'm putting this on. I don't know. We'll see. It's definitely <laughs> moisturizing, but it almost feels kind of like Vaseline. But not that thick. I don't know. Maybe I'll put it in a giveaway. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I just used it. I'm not going to put it in a giveaway. $1.99 for this. It looks like eyebrow powder or eyeshadow. Bless you. Uh, Anna Rose Professional Makeup. Yeah, it's like more like eyebrow powder. You could always use these for um, eyeshadows if you wanted, but I use them as eyebrow powder with my stamp. You guys know I stamp my eyebrows. I'm thinking about doing another like get ready with me with Timu products. You guys can see how I put on my lashes. Honestly, I am no beauty guru, okay? I'm, I'm just not, but I do a very easy routine where face makeup, lashes, eyebrows, blush, and that's about it. So anyway, I use these for the um, eyebrow stamp that I use. So we would test that out. So I think it's a good idea. Maybe I will do a get ready with me. Maybe I'll do it live so we can chat. Let me know if you guys would like that. If you if you want me to do it live so we can, like, chat while I'm getting ready, I would love that. I feel like that would be more interactive and you guys could, like, ask me questions. So let me know in the comments if that would be something you guys would watch and maybe what's a better time or, or day. I'm hoping you say weekend. <laughs> All right. No nails in this haul? What, what am I doing with my life? Okay, so I bought these before and I complained about them before. <laughs> It's the one time where I was like, these are way bigger than I thought they were going to be. Um, these are earrings for $224. I swear I hear like a noise, like a ringing. It's probably just my ears. Anyway, $224 for these. Now, I just think these are going to be way too big for me. This is the earring. Like, look at that thing. It's enormous, okay? It would be pretty but it's enormous. Like, I thought these were going to be, like, a third of the size because you know how it is on Timu. Like, you never know what the size is going to be. But, I mean, they're pretty. They're they're really nice and, like, glittery. And, like, I love this metal part. I mean, I don't know. I feel like I would need to have my hair, like, up and minimal makeup with these because they're going to be the star of the show. So, I don't know. I mean, we may try them. But they're a tad heavy, too, so... You know, I don't know. Two twenty-four for those. I'm not a big fan of heavy, heavy earrings because my one lobe, I already, I ripped it playing softball forever ago, and it, it already, you know, it's a low hanger, anyways. So I hate to like put a lot of weight on that earlobe. Anyway, okay, one ring, one ring in this haul, Samantha. <laughs> Samantha, if you're watching, here's. <laughs> We always talk about, so me and Samantha talk on Facebook chat about um, how, how many rings we bought off Timu. So this ring was $1.79. It's a three-piece kind of like engagement set. Uh, looks like this. Three pieces to it. It, it goes all the way around. Really pretty. Um, it's not like the best quality I've seen or, you know, the best quality I've ever bought, but it's pretty. Um, you know, no, not bad for $1.79. I mean, you know, it could, it could be worse. could be worse. You know, who would know? Who would know from afar, you know? I noticed that, um, whenever you get, like, CZs or white fake diamonds like this, they, ha they tend to have a blue tone to them. And someone told me that that's, like, a thing. So, I don't let it bother me anymore. It, it's really not that bad. And it's kind of pretty. So, I like that. I like that. $1.79, three-piece set. Really pretty. Add it to my collection. Okay, these are <laughs> these are also extremely bougie and a lot bigger than I thought they were going to be. They're about probably like two and a half, three inches long. They were $1.98, and I thought they were going to be like that. So another, wow, this is way bigger than I thought it was going to be. 
And these are some serious statement earrings, okay? They're beautiful, though. These are beautiful. I just don't know where I'm going to wear them. Definitely not in my nightgown like I'm wearing right now. But aren't they beautiful? They they kind of give me a, like, antique, uh, 19, roaring 1920s vibe or something. Like, really bougie and, I don't know, I really like them, though. I really like them. Like, very royal kind of looking, but I have no idea where I'm going to wear them. <laughs> I'm in my pajamas, but I'm definitely not going to wear them in my pajamas. But... What do you guys think? Where would you wear these? Maybe New Year's Eve party? Christmas party? Potentially? Yeah, really nice. They're very well made. So, you know, for $1.98, they're very, very well made. Guys, I know I went through this fast. Last but certainly not least is a whole set of earrings for $314. You get all of these, every single pair for $314. So there's one, two, three, four, five, there's six pairs. Um, they're gold posts, or hoops, or I don't know which one, what do you want, whatever you want to call these. Gold, gold findings, I don't know. Anyway, that's what they look like. Very sparkly and pretty, and you get all kinds of colors. You get this really nice, uh, this is like a lilac, and then there's a pink, and then there's a clear and there's this beautiful green color and then another like peachy pink and then some blue. Really pretty. Really, really nice. You get all six pairs for $314. I mean, those are pretty. Really, really nice. Lots of sparkle going on. I love these. I love them. So yeah, I am looking, also looking on Timu for like some storage options for my jewelry because I have so much of it. Um, so if anybody has any good like storage options for jewelry let me know down below link me to some items um it doesn't even have to be on timu it could even be on like amazon or whatever but i need to store like a lot of rings a lot of necklaces and i would rather them be like closed because you know i just don't want to get dust and stuff on them and i want them to last as long as possible so if you could direct me <laughs> to something like that i would extremely appreciate it and thank you guys so much for sitting through my haul i know it was kind of short but more to come um i'm i'm trying to get a, a timu wig video out for you guys how to style it how to make them look more realistic um and some other things so i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give me a like i would appreciate that and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye!